Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. And today we are going to be going over an update to my cyber stack profile. Now I know like, there was some uh, new cyber stars that came out in Flames of, Flames of Destruction, but I didn't get the set, so I'm just going to work with what I get. And let's jump right into this profile. So first, I run our three... Three Drake Knets. Pick someone that's normal summoned, special summon one level to a lower normal monster from your hand or deck in defense mode. So, yeah, Drake Knets like one of the basic combos with this deck. And, of course, will the three Drake Knets be without three Bitrons and one Digitron? So yeah, I run the three Bitrons as searching, and then just an extra fourth search as Digitron, just in case. So yeah, there's the normal combo piece. One of the first basic combo pieces of the deck. Next up, I also run our three Bit Troopers. Besides being a 2,000 defense point wall, it's also there for special summoning power by sending a level 2 or lower monster from hand to graveyard. And there are a couple targets with that, like there's Bigitron, no, Digitron, Bitron, Stack Reviver, Link Infra, Fra, Infra Flyer, Dot Scaper. Yeah. There's a lot of like targets for this effect. So yeah, there's a reason for that. Then I run on two backup secretaries, just for like the basic special summoning power of the deck. Control cyber, special summon this card to the field. And yeah. I also run our two Link Slayers. Most people they would only run one or not, but I honestly like Link Slayer for its special summoning. Because if you control no monsters, special summon this card to the field. At the same time, you can just destroy some back row with it. Besides being a 2000 attack point monster. Next up, as I mentioned earlier, two stack revivers. I run the stack reviver as a retrieval card at the same time for, again, just linking, retrieval, blah. And as I also mentioned, two link infra flyers. This card's good just for again special summoning power when you control link monsters already, so yeah. Because they're supposed to summon two link monsters on uh, points two. And moving on to like the one ofs, I run one balance reward for the extra normal summon you can get by paying a thousand. And you can banish this card. And if this card is banished, special summon a level 4 or lower from your hand. So, yeah, it's also really good for yeah, special summoning power. I also run is one good staggered. You gain tokens if this card can inflict battle damage, and you can special summon this card when you normal summon. So, yeah, it's like nurse, more summoning power, and whatnot. I also run one Dotscaper. I like the running one because of its effect. You can only use each effect once per duel, so yeah, it's good for just special summoning back to the grave from grave or banish zone. I also run is one client. Just for cards that give off the an extra five hundred attack point boost. And you can also protect this card, but yeah, mainly use it for the attack point boost. Then I also run in as one bat clinker. Basically just special on this card if your opponent controls extra deck monster. At the same time, you can just destroy all extra deck monsters in the extra deck zone, so yeah, if you're you can just definitely mess with your opponent's combos with that one. 
Next up, moving on to like the sheep iron is one Ram Claudia and one Rom Claudia. No, Rom Clouder. Yeah. Run these cards just for their effects. So yeah, those are retrieves, three special summons, and then special summons from graveyard. So yeah. As the last monster I run in this deck is one Cyber Wizard. I honestly just run Cyber Wizard just because why not? It's also just that monster for piercing and yeah. Okay, moving on to spell cards I run. One Dark Hole, destroy all cards on the field, it's a great way to clear. Clear Dark Bolt boys because it doesn't target. Also run is one one time passcode. This gains you a a token. Yeah. Gives you an extra token, so that's good. Um yeah. For more link plays. Also run is one sign up backdoor. Just for the extra searching and team special and basically you can combo this card off with Balancer Lord for more special summoning power. So yeah, it's a great way. And also run is one scapegoat, just for the four tokens you can gain, and then link off of those. I also run uh, one security block. Just some I run this card just for the protection I can gain from effects and battle. They also run the equip spell Unite We Stand. I like this equip spell with this deck because you can easily fill up your board. And with the extra monsters, you can easily just have more monsters you control and then gain attack points because of the monsters you control. So, yeah, it's good. Also, one Sign at Universe. I've always had this card in the deck because I just like how it plays. Like, sure, it has that, it has that effect. That destroys all when this card is destroyed. But at the same time, it's pretty good for the extra attack points. Alright, and well, moving on to trap cards I run is one compulse. Easily just return one card from field to hand. Uh, that next, I run our two cyber beacons. When you take damage, you can easily just search out all four lower cyber monster from your deck and add your hand. Yeah, and just more retrieval and searching. I also run is one parallel port armor. Because it just... You can just gain extra attacks at the same time. It protects your monster, so yeah. I also run one recoded alive. Just for the Link 3 plays, because you got all those talkers, so why not use them to your advantage with this card? Also got Link Restart. This is just an easy way to gain cards from your... So some Link Monsters from your graveyard. So yeah, run one of those. Then the last card on the stick I run is one Phoenix Chain. This card has actually comes in handy like one of the most times in my opinion. Because just stop negate your opponent's card effects at the same time. Yeah. Stop their attacking the can't change battle position. So yeah, it's good. Okay, now moving on to the extra deck, I still run one link spider, just for the instant link one plays. Get it out there, then link down. So yeah. You can start off with. Next I also run is one secure right now. Now combo play I tend to do is bring out Link Spider, combo sling off. Then once I have more monster zones, link off Link Spider into secure right now. Yeah, I tend to use these two like in conjunction with each other, bring out this. Bring out this one. Just for more protection. So yeah. I also run the one binary source source. As a link to and the two arrows point side to side. And, yeah, just life gain and whatnot. Next I also run is one Honeybot. Again, can't be destroyed in protection. Yeah. Well, 
Well, the only life like, monster that I run two of right now is two flame illustrators. You can only control one, but at the same time, it comes out as a 2000. And yeah, it's great for attack booster. I also run one link pumper. Don't really have. Actually, this is like one of the least used card in this deck. I just have it for link two potential, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I also use this one proxy dragon. It's similar to Hangbot, just protection, and yeah. I also won one recovery sorcerer. Just for the. Like, the name says recovery. And, yeah. Also, run is the one underclock taker for for battling. And it's really good for battling because, yeah, his effect. Yeah. And moving on to the link threes, I run Deco Talker, Enco Talker, and Exco Talker. I am looking forward to the new start and structure decks coming up because they have Transco Talker and Power Code Talker. So there'll be more talkers for powering up your decks. Because this one blocks monster zones, gains attack points, and gains attack points for battles. So yeah, this is a good combo piece at the same time. Also, Trigate Wizard. I tend not to use Trigate, I tend to use the talkers more than Trigate. So I'm looking forward to when those decks come out, that way I can integrate whatever they have into this deck. Um, yeah. So anyway guys, that does it for this deck profile of my Cyber deck. If you enjoyed, please leave a like down below. If you have any suggestions for like anything, like dueling or... Actually, if you want to see any of these decks that I've done deck profiles duel face-to-face, -face, let me know down in the comments below. And I'll work on that, see if I can get it done. So anyway, guys, I am Animator, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!